You are a rude, terrible person. И готовы пойти на то, чтобы сделать себя обрезание, то я вас приглашаю в Москву. पहले आग हम तो डिसिप्लिन सोचते हैं अध्यक्ष हमारे लिए सब कुछ होते हैं challenge you on on one of the statements that you made in the tail end of the campaign uh in in the midterms that here, this, here we go that well if let's you don't go, mind mr president Come on. that this caravan was an invasion as you well, know I, mr. I president, consider it to be an as invasion. you know mr president the caravan was not an invasion it's a it's a a group of migrants moving up from central america towards the border with the u.s thank you for telling and me that I I, they're hundreds of miles away though they're hundreds and hundreds of you miles away that, that's I not an invasion should, honestly uh, i think you should let me run the country you run cnn all right. and if you did it well your ratings well, let me would be ask much if, I, if i may okay, ask one enough. other question mr president if i may, if I may ask Peter, one other ahead. question are you worried that's enough that's mr. enough mr. president i'll tell you what cnn should be ashamed of itself having you working for them you are a rude terrible person you shouldn't be working for cnn Monsieur le Président, est-ce que vous pourriez me donner euh, votre définition du mot « privé » puisqu'hier, il y avait beaucoup de caméras, beaucoup de photographes pendant votre visite privée du Taj Mahal Je, je tiens à vous remercier de l'intérêt de votre question euh, après une visite de trois jours dans un pays comme l'Inde euh, qui manifeste euh, toute la richesse que vous avez dû tirer de ce déplacement, tout l'intérêt que vous portez à ces questions stratégiques et à ce que je dis depuis le début de notre rendez-vous. C'est en effet euh, à ce poser la question jusqu'au bout de savoir si ça ne devrait pas être totalement fermé aux médias. Mais je tiens vraiment à vous remercier pour la grande qualité dont vous venez de faire preuve. S'il y a des questions de fond, je les prends toutes. Don't you think that by trying to eradicate terrorism in Chechnya, you are going to eradicate the uh, civilian population of Chechnya? Если вы хотите совсем уж стать исламским радикалом, и готовы пойти на то, чтобы сделать себе обрезание, то я вас приглашаю в Москву. У нас многоконфессиональная страна, у нас есть специалисты по этому вопросу. И я порекомендую ему сделать эту операцию таким образом, чтобы у вас уже больше ничего не выросло. So therefore the question is, is it okay for a PM to take maternity leave uh -huh. while in office? Okay. Can you do this job? Do you want kids? Uh, what about yeah. this whole question about, you know, uh, work and babies yeah. and families? Do you find but this an inappropriate question? For me, no, because I opened myself up to it. But you, for other women, it is totally unacceptable in 2017 to say that women should have to answer that question in the workplace. But this is my that point. Is no, I'm going to count that. I'm no, it that is that unacceptable. Okay, in 2017. In this country, since you became president, in the five months since you became president, more people have actually been killed than died during the nine years of the Marcos dictatorship, which we've also been talking well, about. I could ask the same question. Why is America losing 40,000 lives, uh, drug-related cases? You do not do that to me. When you are a hypocrite to me, you are a hypocrite. Thank you, Mr. President.